Icon FJ40 Old School Review, New Tech, Vintage Aesthetic. It's exceptional to consider Jonathan Ward began the Icon mark over 10 years prior. At first start with his Toyota Land Cruiser Reclamation Shop, TLC, Ward has since changed his business to incorporate the creation of hand-constructed custom vehicles from the Icon FJ and Bronco to the erratic derelict and reformer ventures. With more than 125 FJs and about 50 Broncos finished and conveyed to clients, he's demonstrated that there is a fruitful plan of action to matching exemplary styling with current tech, regardless of whether the sticker price is distant for generally purchasers. It had been for a little while since we last checked in with Ward, the last time was in the driver's seat of his then-new Bronco in 2011, so when we heard he had made another adaptation of the Icon FJ, we went to his shop in Chatsworth, California, to see it in the metal. It's exceptional to consider Jonathan Ward began the Icon mark over 10 years prior. At first start with his Toyota Land Cruiser reclamation shop. TLC, Ward has since changed his business to incorporate the creation of hand-constructed custom vehicles from the Icon FJ and Bronco to the erratic derelict and reformer ventures. With more than 125 FJs and about 50 Broncos finished and conveyed to clients, he's demonstrated that there is a fruitful plan of action to matching exemplary styling with current tech regardless of whether the sticker price is distant for generally purchasers. It had been for a little while since we last checked in with Ward, the last time was in the driver's seat of his then-new Bronco in 2011, so when we heard he had made another adaptation of the Icon FJ, we went to his shop in Chatsworth, California, to see it in the metal. We were curious why Ward didn't offer something like this from the start but he explained that it was initially necessary to demonstrate that his vehicles weren't just a restoration or lightly modified. Mechanically, they, the Icon FJ models, were such a different approach that I felt the modern, industrial aesthetic that I developed for it was necessary to get people to understand it was something different. Those familiar with the Toyota FJ40 models will be able to easily spot the design cues inspired by the originals, from the white headlight bezel, to the stainless windshield frame and hood hooks, to the rear tire carrier. The front and rear bumpers are painted in a silver hue inspired by the original, but are powder coated and then clear coated to discourage scratching. There are a few modern looking components on the exterior namely the LED headlights and taillights, but the headlights in particular have been redesigned to fit in with the vintage look. The icon badging on the exterior is still there, although much more subtle than on the standard model. Perhaps our favorite exterior design features are the original style forged aluminum wheels and original hubcaps that really complete the vintage look, 